guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ash Babes, aka Namuko Magic here. And if you haven't yet, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment, and do the things that need to be done right here on this one channel. So, welcome back. Should I say welcome back to myself or whatever? Happy 2024, guys. Happy, Happy 2020. Year. Happy New Year. Feels good luck. Leave a mic. It's good. <laughs> but anyway, so happy 2024 guys. I hope everything is great. Everything is going and all your wishes and dreams and you know, yeah. all your resolutions. You know, all of us have resolutions of losing weight, going to the gym. That's the common one. <laughs> That is the common one. That's the common one, you know, making more money, yeah. you know, getting more closer to God. Whatever, you know, your resolution is personal yeah. to you. Um, I just wish it all comes and we walk, walk towards it, you know, so. Yeah. With that being said, I'm back, guys, and um, I'm not leaving anytime soon. Y'all will be tired of me. Of me. <laughs> Okay, because I took this so much time sure. off this year for sure. You guys will be tired of me. Um, and yeah, so I'm back. And um, this is, before I say anything else, this is Elpsy. Anyway, my name is Albi. I am what? <laughs> what am I? Really? Of you. My, my friend, Albi. <laughs> <laughs> the one and only. The one and only. Albi anyway, um, is. Yeah. I'm just. Yeah, like, she's in flesh. Um, I'm finally here in flesh, <laughs> literally. I I have been gone. You have been gone, Chummy. Would you betray uh -huh. a friend for one milli? For for one, one million. million? Is it US or Namibia? The currency Honestly, is very important. Honestly, simple, simple answer would be no. If it was five million, yes. Right. right. But <laughs> five or more. Five or more, yeah. In a heartbeat, that right, right, right. But no, for million, but one no. million, it's I love my friends too much. Okay, for one million, right. I would not. Okay, what else? Okay, do you believe in an afterlife? Yeah, I do actually. You do? Yeah, because you know when you like have like little dreams from your, from people. That That's what I was gonna say. Stuff. Yeah, I do believe right. in it. I yeah, believe I, it. I believe that yeah. too. Yeah. I believe there's an afterlife. Facts. For sure, for sure. Because and it can just how the spirit. And I think world. that also for me personally, that helps me to also live life in a godly way as much as I can mm -hmm. because you don't really know how the afterlife is like. Mm -hmm. You know, and like I think there is and I, I think a lot of people should live accordingly. accordingly. Would you take the blame for a major crime? To save a best friend's life. A best friend? Yeah, life. So basically, mean you'll be under the jail or something to save their life. If take if they time. had health issues or very serious issues, I probably would. If not, if they did it. The interesting questions. <laughs> if they did, yeah. I honestly, knowing that they could take the responsibility for it. I and knowing that wouldn't. it was something effed up that they maybe did. Yeah. You know what I'm like saying? Maybe, yeah. I was not even involved. If maybe I was involved halfway through. I would, you know, yeah. but if I was not even involved and I have to take the blame for you because I was maybe seen at the scene, hell no. You were not even seen at the scene, Chami. This is just you just taking it for your uh. friend. <laughs> so, yes It depends no. which friend. That's what yes I'm gonna... or no? Depends you, which would you friend. go under the jail? Like, my question would be... Depends which would friend. Would you go under the jail for somebody that knew they were doing committing a crime, though? That's the difference. It's a difference when somebody friend, was... Though. It's my friend. Why well, I wouldn't if you're gonna go I mean, out and actively do a yeah, crime. No. You know what I'm saying? In that's that sense. Yes. That's true. But but if my friend has cancer or like it's like has a life threatening situation, I might take the blame for them. Okay, I get I it. Like, Alright. But my thing is it but depends depend on not, the circumstance. It, it depends. That's why I'm yeah. saying like depends what friend. Depends the, and that all comes with if the friend is sick, like it all falls under that umbrella, right? So it depends which friend, but I might. That, okay. That's my answer. Well, I me, mean, it depends on the situation because if you're gonna actively go commit a crime, you'll go under the jail. <laughs> um, <laughs> well, so you're not gonna sit under the jail for, for me, it depends. <laughs> It depends. It depends. So I think it, it depends. Me. Honestly, it depends. Okay. Would you want to be a millionaire if it meant you would never find true love? Well, it gotta be a few million though. Oh no, millionaire? 
hell to the fucking end. One million it could be one million me, or comes, one million. When it comes to love, I would take I would even take a five hundred thousand. <laughs> Who wants to go through heartbreak and all that bullshit? Like come on. Out money money is the freaking and so greatest general. thing that you can have on this planet. So why not take money then have a heartbreak? And there's no love out here. What At I would not do for me. There's no love out here. Oh, sorry. What I would do. <laughs> I don't know. What sorry, I no. would do. And they, they gotta have to give me a me, few minutes. Like five minutes. Uh, no. For me, maybe it's not. Show me. Yo. Maybe in th maybe even three million. Okay. And show five. me. I want a million dollars even. <laughs> I don't care. If oh, you yeah, could, I read okay. that one. If you could find out how you were going to die, would you want to know how you would find? Yeah. Would you want to find you out? You know what? I saw this question on the internet before, and someone said, "What did they say?" They said, "Yeah, if 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 it was like through an accident, I would avoid and stay home." Right. That's actually what they said. You know what? Or That's not drive. Uh, right. Or not. But doesn't even mean drive. Like right, it could you be could anything. not even be a driver and right, be right. in an accident. Right. But I remember they said, "I'll avoid going <laughs> outside. Like I'll stay home, kind of thing." I agree with For that me, statement. I would just say no. Yeah, me too. It's definitely no. Right. Like I don't want to know. I don't want to know yeah. at all. At all, please. Say okay. Please. If any authority figure accused one of your loved ones of doing something terrible, would you believe them? All right. All right. Um, it was the question is for me, right? So I mean, it's for both of us. We can yeah. answer, but I, I, yeah, you, answer you have to answer. Yes. Yeah. So, um, uh, no, honestly, no, 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 like, no. I would not believe it at all. I'm not even going to sit here in front and cap and lie. Honestly, I will not believe it. Honestly, what does it say? If you would find um, if. If if an authority figure like police, whoever the person is, if they will tell you your loved one was doing something uh, terrible, would you believe them? Um, of, if it comes from a police officer, it might be that they have all the facts. Right. It it could be both ways. Right, right. But I just <sighs> actually had a s same incident back home, where someone that I really thought would never ever commit a crime actually committed it, yeah. and I was like. There's no way in this freaking life that my childhood friend committed this. But they were also accused by by the authority. Yeah, they got it got to come my brother. Sense. Hell no, I'm not believing you. First of all, I yeah. know that boy. First of all, <laughs> I know my brother. First of all, like, if it's no. anybody that I love and whatever, right. it, you don't have to. You had to Even come if with it's me. Yeah, and like, you wouldn't me. believe me. No, right. they don't have I to come with it. Like they before they even say it, they need to present. Yeah, no. and then they gotta I, present it and I say it. Then, then maybe uh, even then I'll be like, this is this might be fake news. Um, but anyway, okay. <laughs> if you would, if you would bring a loved one back to life, but they would have no memory of you, would you do it? Yeah. Ooh, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I definitely. You know what? hundred yeah. percent will do that yeah i think i would i absolutely will do it because you know what like i think it's not even them not knowing you it's just like seeing them just seeing them face. and being them alive them and being just, alive even and if living. they don't know you at least know no. that that's my family right. that's my person right and definitely being, being there, there for them yeah. like Tell me, I, I will become a stalker first of all because they have no memory of you they don't right. know you right? right so obviously outright it'll give stalkerish right because Stalker i right. will find a way to infiltrate into their lives into yeah. their you know those stalker movies where they are around the family they don't even know you following them well, following right. around or whatever right. but i will so, follow them around come to the they yeah. run into them at a supermarket or show me something they will run I into me too. i will become an, a stalker and obviously i wouldn't tell them you you do 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 but just it's just even on a friendship level i still would want to be in their lives right. you know yeah. so i will bring them back and i will find a way to infiltrate into their lives and become part of the circle however right. that is i will find them what's a favorite memory of us you and i yeah oh my god i feel like i do i have to answer that first yeah 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 i was asking 
I wanted you to answer first. But... <laughs> no, because I honestly have to think. Honestly, right? Because like I, <gasps> I really have a lot with you. But you know my favorite. My favorite is like when I'm fast. I think my favorite is when like we are literally like we look like hobos. We get in the car. And we like go for ice cream because we love to go for like an ice cream date like homeless people. with me, you and Light. Yeah, like I think yeah. that's my favorite thing. Yeah. That's like oh, the three you know, of us. Oh, you want to know ice cream? I think well, that's my favorite. Now that you said that, I'm gonna pick your bank off of that. My favorite memory of us, including Light Night, mm -hmm. is um, when we when we had our little sushi day in the car yeah that was like had, really dope we had all the snacks and all the sushi yeah that was nice it was so she cute. loved it oh, she and loved i sushi. and we all love sushi isn't that right. crazy if you found out the world was ending in 30 minutes do you know what you would do in that half an hour she said yes i would fly home and i said halfway you been even home listen home is 20 at least 21 hours right. to be home right. and to go home to namibia yeah so I was like, you wouldn't even be halfway through. <laughs> and she was like, she was thinking First like, all, what else? My, I'm thinking in my head, really? well, like, well, the 30 minutes come with magic powers. <laughs> <laughs> no, you only got 30. Oh, man. 30. But then I have to do, should uh, like do a quick uh, WhatsApp video call. <laughs> I think I think a WhatsApp call would be better. Yeah, I'll, I'll just have to anything. do a WhatsApp yeah. video call, maybe for five minutes. Yeah, no. And then um, maybe for five minutes, I'll do a WhatsApp call, and then I will do what? I take a I'll, shot. Yeah. <laughs> First I of all, I'll no. take a shot, and then you know do what the video I'll do? Call. I will repent. No, listen. I it's would really minutes. repent. It's 30 minutes, but show me you can't do all of that and think God is listen. gonna forgive you in 30 minutes. God is not hard. Take a shot. God knows my heart. What I'll do when I, I find I out. Know. When I find out, you know. Guys. God is not gonna forgive you. When I find out no. that I've got 30 minutes left, what I will do is take a shot immediately. While I'm taking the shot, I'm calling on WhatsApp. Talking to my mama, to my mother oh, and everybody. She's already going to hell. And then, okay. by the she's 20 minute mark, I'm repenting and telling God knows my heart. God knows my heart. Well, that's true. And that's all that matters. You I am gonna. Come as you are. And come as Any you minute, are. any time. And that is how I'm coming as I am. <laughs> 20 minutes before. To each its own. I'm gonna okay. and then I'm gonna kiss my family, love on my baby light and you my can't family. Your, your family is they here most well in the house. Some well, of them. When we will find out some of them. Well shoot. So the WhatsApp call is for Africa. Africa is dying. <laughs> so my, I might have to cut the Africa call to five minutes. Right. So I can have enough time. I don't oh, even know what I'm gonna do. I don't even and honestly, I think honestly I'll funny. probably just repent. Like I, that that my, would, I think I'll just pray. Yeah. Because I really do believe there's an afterlife, so like I'll just pray. Yeah, me too. Um, so I'm just talking, I definitely will pray. Um the last question is what are you most guilty about? Guilty of guilty about. What are you most guilty about? Ooh. Mm. Um, giving my heart to the wrong people. Mm. I think I'm I think I'm really coming to terms with that. Like I it's still hard for me to like forgive myself for giving my heart to people that didn't deserve it. But you wanna know to your to your credit, you never know who people are because the pe what people present themselves as when they come. No, but this is, is more of like coming from what I know so far and so far I feel like that's what I wouldn't That's, that's what, what I feel guilty about. I feel most guilty about. No, but I'm still i I'm trying to say but to your credit what i'm trying to say is yeah. when you meet somebody for the first time it doesn't matter who it is right they always give you their best parts right they give you for the most part like for a month or two or three or a six month. if they if that's a stretch I got it for a month. um okay but I, i'm just saying people give you right that they, they do. Say the laugh either won't way be. They like give either you way the they best. will give you the best yeah. part so and, and then obviously when they, somebody gives you their best parts yeah, that's what makes it hard when you realize, oh, right. this ain't shit. To really just, you know, kind right. of immediately, you know, like bounce. But but you know what? I think, I think as 
and i'm not doing making this even for culture or whatever yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i think it's like young women when we go into a relationship as naive as i was i think we really ignore the red flags like we feel like oh this could be adjusted These are green. it could be adjusted along the way you yeah. know um and it and when it doesn't happen we really yeah, tend to turn into and people that we are not not right. and that we never would have imagined we would be Absolutely. you know what i mean Absolutely. so i think yeah. i think um yeah no you're feeling I you, think, you, you're I think, guilty about I that. think giving my heart to the wrong people. Okay. And honestly, you this we are how many I'm, people in this freaking Well guys, see you later. Bye guys. Thank you guys for watching the video and we'll catch you later. Yeah, subscribe, so, please. Subscribe. Don't forget. Is this mine? Don't forget. Don't forget. <laughs>